Axe Reaver? Hmm. Me. Are you? No, you. 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 Okay. In the home stretch of this one. There. There. Support. Hello, Ford. Hmm? Oh, Kyle. How have you been? What are you doing out here? Are you... Are you painting? No, I... Well, yes, actually, I'm not so much painting as sketching. I use this piece of charcoal to draw and shade like this. You know we're in the middle of battle, don't you? What if someone attacks while you're distracted? Calm down, calm down. I just like to keep a record of our battles with these pictures. You're just rationalizing. You're a cavalier. It's time to start acting like one. Fine, fine. I'll stop. As you command, Sir Kyle, Commander, Andrew of the Knights of the Renes. Oh, bother. Do you have to make everything so difficult? If you don't want the hassle, stop telling me what to do. Then stop fooling around on the battlefield. <laughs> Seriously, wasting my time... I'm on an idiot like you is just stupid. Huh? Did you say something? Nothing. If you have so much time to waste drawing, let's have a quick spar. What? You want to spar now? Yeah, that's right. I don't waste time. I take care of my weapons, my horse, and myself. And not just that, I also make sure our morale is good and our men are safe. You're thorough, aren't you? I'm a knight. It's my duty. You really need to take yourself less seriously. And you need to take yourself more seriously. Take your duty more seriously. Yay! Those are the kind of support things I miss. Because you can tell they have history. Okay, there's still a few more bowmen. Okay. Only seven left. What's your... Resistance is three. Resistance is one. You two are not going to the front. You're ten. You're two. You're five. Five. Nine. You're probably high as well, because you're also a mage. Probably should have checked. Didn't. Sticking with it. And once again, keep missing that staff opportunity. Ugh. You want for Lute? Why Lute? Why are you gonna be mean? Lute, why you miss? Okay, at least you hit on the second one. And yeah, lightning is better. Miss. And. Mainly the only risky one down. Aside from the bowmen. And the bowmen are really only risky for Tanya.
over there. Joshua. Nemi. Now stuff. God, Joshua, you're doing some good work. Getting some levels. Okay, I'm going to move you out one. Because you really haven't given enough chances to do much. You can move up one of the stairs so that way she can get in to heal you. Because you're taking some abuse. Oh, that crit earlier. That one, I probably would have cried. I said this was started to be sort of no reset. The main reason for that is I think it would be much harder to get through if I just reset anytime an outcome happened or a character died that I didn't want to, so. It'd be even harder to actually get through the game. Plus, Fire Emblem's kind of like the original Nuzlocke in the way of, especially in classic mode, of if you lost a character during this level, guess what? They're gone. Permanently. <laughs> From use, at least. They're in the story, but you cannot use them, so. It's the original Nuzlocke. But... You at least don't have to release some yourself. Which I don't know about anyone else. I adapted. So when I buy a Pokemon game, I don't plan on playing it more than once. So I adapted sort of the Nuzlocke style of rules to not have to reset progress. So I can still get through it, because if I had to reset progress, basically, i I get more annoyed with it than anything else. So what I sort of adopted for that area was basically still nicknaming all the Pokemon, not grinding out areas to catch more than one, and and usually at the start it's only one at a time. I mean, if I see like a rare one for a second time in an area, I may still catch it. But it's usually I try to stick to one 
in my initial initial walk through the area area but I'll still go back and get more like when I need to backtrack or grind for levels in that case so still nicknaming catching minimally and the main thing I took away was never use revives train for the battle so you never need to use them and if my team wipes it's sort of like that's basically where I consider my nuzlocke to be over like I'll do the strict more strict rules at the start of only one Pokemon nicknaming them all if they die they're gone on and not even at the if they die they're gone but on but on but I'll do the more strict in terms of catching but then going forward from there or after if I have a team wipe it's sort of I get more lax with myself on it that's a really rare weapon and it doesn't do enough damage for me to actually use it against you Seth how much you do You'd do more if it were this. No, you wouldn't do much more. And you do not have enough health. Okay. We're gonna use a mend. Ah, oh, that wasn't much more health than I would have liked. Okay. Come forward. Come forward. Come forward. You also need to be happy. Set them to pop you right now. Let the enemy attack you in his face. Blast, this ain't right. These guys are too tough. 5,000 gold ain't nearly enough for this. They only put 5,000 gold on catching the princess of a country. They put a 5,000 bounty. That seems so low. That is so low. That's ridiculously low. For catching a princess. Ooh, you don't have a range. So, I'm just gonna pelt you a little bit. <laughs> With some fire. And then Nami's just gonna... skewer you with an arrow. Arthur, how much damage are you doing? Oh, you can take him out. Let's get a couple other things done first. Gilliam, I thank you for being my behind tank guard. Bringing up the rear. Erica, can you kill? You cannot kill. Definitely can't kill. Rapier, still cannot kill. Joshua, what are you looking at? You can just kill. But you are level 10. Arthur's level 8. So Arthur gets to kill. And you crit at the end of it. I'm pretty sure that was a crit. That stinking Pablo, he lied to me. Pablo? Pablo put out the hit. It's been a while. I don't remember who the hell Pablo is. Your Highness, are you well? Yes, I believe so. Who are these men? They don't appear to be Grotto Imperial troops. Judging by their crude swordplay, I'd say they're mercenaries. We can't expect more of them in the area too. We can expect more of them in the area too. I think. Wait here. 
Wait, I give up? I don't want to fight anymore. We were just doing a job. Who hired you? I may be nothing but a hired blade, but I have my honor. I won't say a word. I admire your professionalism. I guess we have no use for you. No, wait, I'll talk. Carcino. It was Pablo of the Carcino Council of Elders. Councilman Pablo? That doesn't make sense. Carcino and Frail and Leia are allies. Why would they target me? I don't know. Could be they've decided Grotto's going, going to win. They want to be on the winning side. Some of the others oppose Pablo, but I heard Erdy had them all silenced. But quick. That's all I know. I swear it. I believe you. Go. We were careless. We should have seen this coming. Garcina is a young and ambitious nation, ruled by a power hungry, ruled by power hungry merchants. And Grotto is growing more, more powerful with every passing day. So it's no surprise Garcina's merchants, lo merchant lords, would throw in. I'm with Grotto now. Wait, Prince Ines. Prince Ines supposed to pass through Carcino on his way to Jahana. If Carcino has betrayed us, then he ran headlong into enemy territory. Princess Erica. I thought that was Hannah for a second. I bring dire tidings. I know you. You are a messenger riding with the Prince Instant S. Yes, and I have news of him. Prince S is in, Jane in danger. Christina's merchant army struck up and cut through half our men. The prince is trapped in a siege. He has no means of escape, and... No more. I understand. Return to Freyleia and deliver your message. What a prince and S. Leave him to us. The prince's trouble although should burden you no more. We will see him to safety. Do, do, do. One more chapter down.